Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're doing an unboxing again, and this time we're doing an unboxing of our March Boxy Charm. So, um, yeah, let's stop talking and let's jump right into this video, guys. All right, so we're jumping right into this video, like I just said. So the first product that we're gonna get into today is a eyeshadow palette. And this palette is from Lime Crime Venus 3 Eyeshadow Palette. This is the front of it. This is the back of it. This palette is vegan and cruelty free. We open it right up. This is what we're working with shade wise. Really pretty, very, um, I guess purple dream isk. <laughs> Um, but this palette does retail for $38 outside of the box. Um, so I think that is a little pricey for such a small palette. It only has eight shades, but I haven't swatched them, so I don't know how the um, shadows feel or how they work or the pigmentation or anything. So just from a quick perspective, I don't know if it's necessarily worth the $38 but I can't wait to try it and see what it um, performs like. All right, the next thing we have here is the um, Too Faced Damn Girl, I think that's what it's, yeah. <laughs> Too Faced Damn Girl, Damn Girl Mascara. This is the packaging right here. Let's open her up. This mascara does retail for $26. Um, which is normally not bad for mascara, especially if it's quality. I really like the packaging. It's very sturdy. Um, I love the like gemstone vibe it has, like crystal vibe. Um, open her and her up. Ooh, that is a thick wand, but I love a thick wand like this, especially when I'm just trying to do a natural lash, like when I don't want any false lashes on, when I just want to work my natural lashes. I love a big brush like this to really get in there and coat the lashes fully. So I'm really excited um, and I can't wait to try this and see how it performs. Ooh, my head is getting cut off a little bit. That's a little better. All right, um, like I said, that does retail for $26, so that is not bad for a mascara. Um, the next product that we're hopping into is from Maven Beauty. Um, this is the box on the outside. This is a setting spray, a rose water setting spray. This is what it looks like from the packaging. Really cute, very simplistic, but you really don't need um, a real extravagant bottle when it comes to setting spray. Let's open it up. Ooh, a really fresh smell. Like it's not very strong. Not very overpowering, but it's very fresh and very floral. I really can't wait to use this, um, especially because it's, like I said, March and we're slowly going into spring. So I feel like this will be a really beautiful springtime setting spray. Um, I just really can't wait to see how it really sets the makeup and locks it into place and see how long it honestly wears for. So that will be really interesting. That does retail for $22 which is honestly a good medium um, for a setting spray because I have two of them sitting here right now. Um, I have one really higher end priced and one drugstore priced. Um, this one retails for 20, or no, this retails for $32. Um, and this is 0.4 fluid ounces. This is 2.7 fluid ounces. This retails for $10. So you guys can see you know a size difference here so this one is 3.38 fluid ounces and for $22 it is a good medium in size as you can see from the other two and um, this setting spray is vegan as well um, that I see on the back here so that's good to know all right let's hop into the next product let's put those up real fast the next thing we have in our boxy charms this month is a lip oil. This is from Cobb Cosmetics. Right here. The packaging is really simple, really cute. Ooh, I love the way this looks. I love this, like, really, like, what do you call it? A glacier blue shade, I guess. I really am digging that glacier blue shade. 
Um, once again, a very simplistic, very chic packaging. Um, and it looks like this is a cruelty-free lip oil as well. This lip oil does retail for $20, which is not bad because it looks like we have a decent amount of um, product in here. And this... Oh, okay. It doesn't really smell like it, but this is called Blue Raspberry. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see that because it's really, really small. Let's see if it focuses... I don't know if you can see it, but it says blue raspberry right there. Maybe they're referring to the shade color because it smells just like coconut. Like, it's so tropic. Um, definitely a really good, probably, summertime uh, lip oil you store in your bag when you're running, uh, running out to the beach, running out to the water park, anything like that. Like I said, it smells exactly like coconut. It's very tropical. Um, but I'm guessing the blue raspberry name is the shade of it, so I'm really digging the blue. Alright, and last but not least in our boxy charms for this month, we got a wet brush cleaning system with a silicone scrubbing pad from Lavish Beauty. Or, I don't know if it's Lavish Beauty or Lavish Cosmetics. Um, it's just called Lavish <laughs> on the thing. So, here it is. This is what the container looks like. Um, this is vegan as well, so it looks like all of our products that we got in this month is, um, for the most part, vegan and cruelty-free, which is really awesome and really spot-on. So this is what the soap looks like, and this is that silicone brush that they're talking about on the inside, and it looks like, ooh, guys, look, it has a, um, suction cup pad to um, go on the inside so it doesn't just sit in there it actually suction cups into there so you can actually suction cup this to the side of your sink which is really cool um, this does come into packaging so you'll have to take the wrapper off but this honestly came in perfect timing because um, I'm running out of my other one real quickly I will show you guys where did it go I'm actually running out of my Beauty Blender Solid. Um, I've had this for quite some time now. This is the um, so <laughs> Beauty. God, why can't I talk today? This is the Beauty Soap I normally use to clean my brushes. Um, come on, focus. It's focusing on me. Focus on the product. This is normally the soap I use to clean my beauty brushes and my sponges. Um, it's from Beauty Blender. Like I said, um, I've used the crap out of this. This is uh, $16 for one ounce of product, which I think is really awesome. Um, so this one is 1.5 ounces of product, so you get 0.5 more ounces of product. And this is $15, so you get a dollar less for 0.5 more product like amount of product so I think that's really cool because like you see I ran out of the product already so I was just about to buy a new one so it gives me the perfect opportunity and the perfect chance to test this out and see what I think of it so I will have to let you guys know my opinions and how I feel about that here in the near future but otherwise that is all for our beauty box this month guys awesome Alright guys, well that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing for our March Boxy Charm. Um, so yeah, the next videos that are coming out this month will be some graphic liner. I don't think the whole month is going to be around graphic liner. But I'm trying to get a second video out this week. Um, well maybe not, I don't know. I don't know when this video is going out first. I should maybe not say this week because this video might go out next week. The video I might record later will be for this week because this coming Wednesday is St. Patrick's Day off. Oh, screw all that. Hey, all right, guys. <laughs> all right, that is all for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed our uh, March Boxy Charms unboxing. Um, I really loved everything I got so far. I can't wait to test all the products out and let you guys know what I think of it. I hope you guys stay tuned for next week when I post my next video. Um, but yeah, guys, I can't wait to catch you then, and I hope you guys are loving all the changes that you're seeing on my channel. If you can't tell, there's a new backdrop in this week's video, and 
from now on. So no more dark backgrounds. I hope everyone loves the light background I have going on. And I hope you all enjoy everything, everything that is to come on my channel. Um, and I can't wait to grow with you guys. This is our year and let's make the best of it. Alright guys, see you in the next one. Peace.